Hi, this is Shannon and welcome to the Insight for the month of February. Um, I am in Australia right now, so I am shooting my video out in my sister's backyard with the lovely kangaroo paws behind me. Um, for those of you that are new to the Insight, I send out um, this Insight once a month and it gives a breakdown on what's coming in for the next month. And I pull two cards from my deck, the words to the wise oracle, and one represents our physical plane, the world where we feel we can control things but we normally can't and then uh, the spiritual plane which is our higher purpose and of course I pull the cards from my deck the words of the wise oracle that's all the magpies in the background that you can hear actually magpies and parrots so um, on the spiritual plane is a card called divine force and divine force obviously talks about protection it talks about a greater purpose it talks about um, no matter how much you worry about things in your little personality mind, that there's actually a plan and and things are on course as long as, as, long as you stay true to yourself. Um, then in the physical plane, we have a card called Mastering Simplicity. Now, Mastering Simplicity talks about um, not taking on too much. It talks about focusing on the one thing that gets you further forward and prioritizing. One of the hardest things for us to do in our lives is to avoid chaos and to avoid chaos by not putting things in order that don't count, putting things ahead um, that we emotionally feel attached to instead of focusing on the things that actually help us in our lives. And sometimes when we get overwhelmed, we feel like we're really dealing with things by ourselves, that we're alone. And the divine force in the spiritual plane kind of says, that even though you go through these moments of hopelessness, you go through these moments of feeling like, what the heck am I doing? Um, that there is an order to things, that even these times are necessary. And the best way for you to get through these times is to master the simplicity of focusing on the one thing that does you the most good at this time and point in time and moves you forward. Um, chaos really takes over us with indecision uh, but it really takes over when we try to focus on too many things that don't serve us. But for some reason we're emotionally attached to them or other people are putting pressure on us. Oh, we need to know that. We need you to do this. We need, And you start to prioritize things that don't really serve you for your highest good. And I'm not talking in a selfish way. I'm not talking about just doing things like, you know, as we'd say here, buggy you, Jack, I'm all right. I'm going to do this and, and you can go wherever you want to go. It's about prioritizing things that serve your highest purpose. So it's also, you know, prioritize things that better you as a person. You know, don't necessarily prioritize things that are selfish aspects of yourself because they will create more chaos because they throw you out of balance. You know, the more you step away from your true self, um, the more you get into this point of chaos because it's not who you are and you, you slip into depression and you slip into places where you can't feel like you can pull yourself out of or make a decision so you know with divine force in the spiritual plane it really says that that is not who you are when you go to that space that that's a place where you have slipped into because you've allowed chaos to step in and and allow you to prioritize things that don't serve you best and, and bring you to your higher self. So um, have a wonderful February. I hope to be back in the um, United States on the 15th of February and then hopefully back in Albany, uh, New York at the beginning of March. So thanks a lot and have a wonderful month.